Hello and welcome back. What you're looking at is my Astron RS70A power supply. Just got it off of eBay. Very good shape. And it's also, as you know, a very good power supply. What I plan on doing is making it just a little bit better. This particular model is a fixed voltage. There's a variable on the inside of it, which you can tweak a little bit, but uh, it doesn't have any meters on it and there's no external control. And uh, I'm okay with that. But what I want to do is just add a little extra to it. And what I have planned is this one farad capacitor with a digital readout. So what I want to do is hook this up to the power supply and have the voltage being displayed as well. So my plan is to probably stick it on the top of the case there and so I'll be able to see the uh, voltage as well. And uh, that's it. That's my project. It's, uh, it may seem madness, but I think it's a good idea. So I'm just going to crack open this package here and see how physically uh, where it can be put. Okay, I've got it out of the uh, packaging. That's a big capacitor. One ferret. Digital readout. This is used uh, in the automotive industry. industry. Uh, they use a lot of these. So I got a good deal on that, got a good deal on the power supply, so I figured I'd put them together. So, uh, initially, you know, they have uh, the mounting brackets here, and I've been able to uh, loosen this one here, and I'll show you why I loosened it. And uh, this one uh, up top here seems to be a little more troublesome. This seems to be all one molded piece here, and then it's secured at the top here. I don't know how I can... Uh, loosen these pieces here so I can spin the plastic here but I'm gonna have to figure that out because let me move the power supply a little closer if I put this up here and then here's the digital reader I can still see it it's going to be on the floor and that might just be okay but what I was thinking was that if I spin the capacitor so that the readout is uh, showing a little easier, angle it a little bit better. It's not something I'm going to be monitoring all the time, but just can, so I can quickly glance at it and see that the voltage is uh, okay. So let me move this in a little closer. So if I was to put it in the back here, okay, so that's the. Uh, physical mounting of the capacitor. Let me just spin this around. Very heavy power supply. So if I have this physically mounted there, here's my terminals. You better lighting on that one. So here's my terminals. I'll uh, run some uh, 8 gauge wire from here to here and I've got my hookups here to my external devices. I think that should do her. I believe this is going to, of course adding extra capacitance to the output it's definitely going to uh, stabilize. This thing is made for high current. It's made for high power amplifiers in the audio end of things. So uh, I think it's going to fit in there just perfect.